Hello everyone, in this video let us take a look at MAMP which is a very good package to set up Apache, MySQL and PHP on your uh, machine. So to set up MySQL, Apache and PHP on your machine, you can do it manually by installing all three of them and then configuring them, but it can be a bit cumbersome. To solve this problem, there is a package, a very popular package called MAMP. If you go to this uh, website called MAMP.info, you can actually download their uh, package, their free package, their free software that uh, will help you in setting up uh, Apache, MySQL and PHP within a few minutes. So if you download MAMP on your computer, you can then uh, uh, simply click on a button to run all the three servers. So you have the option to download MAMP on either Mac or Windows. So if you're using Mac, I recommend that you just install MAMP, but for Windows, we'll take a look at a different package in a different video. So after you install MAMP on your computer, in this case, we're talking about MAMP, uh, we are talking about Mac, uh, you will be uh, presented with this uh, option to start the server. So in the beginning, without worrying about any configuration, if you click on the start servers button, it will actually start uh, all the three servers for you. And uh, you will get something like this, where you will have the option to take a look at uh, various uh, things that are related to the server. So on this particular URL called localhost colon 8888 slash MAMP, it is your start page in uh, in your MAMP uh, configuration. And uh, you can take a look at the MySQL details, the host name, port number, username and password. You have the option to also take a look at your PHP info. So if you click on PHP info link here, it will give you all the options that you have configured uh, available on your machine and you also have the option to uh, use PHP my admin which is a very good tool for uh, managing your MySQL database. So to begin your uh, Drupal development journey you need to first understand uh, uh, the document route where you will be copying your Drupal folder. So if you go to the MAMP uh, uh, configurations on top, you can take a look at the preferences. And uh, when you look at the preferences, you have this uh, document route, which is set up on uh, this specific URL. Of course, you can change it to uh, not, not really not really URL, but it is a folder on your uh, Mac, but this can be changed. Right now, this is uh, configured at this particular uh, location called uh, applications uh, map. And then uh, there's a folder called uh, HT docs. If you click on the button called show in finder, it will open that particular uh, folder for you where you can actually copy your uh, Drupal folder and then you can start your uh, Drupal development journey. So in this case, I have uh, two test folders, test one and test each of these folders. Uh, they have their own uh, index.html file. If I go back to my browser and if I click on the link called my website, I can see that those two folders are listed here and the HTML files can be opened or accessed when I click on these two links on my localhost column 8888. So this is just an example of how you can uh, set up a, a, a web development environment with Apache, MySQL and PHP. In the later videos when we'll be configuring uh, Drupal, we'll see how we can uh, install Drupal on a local uh, Mac or maybe a Windows machine and then we'll start uh, configuring and uh, playing with the Drupal uh, website. So I hope this uh, video was useful. Thank you very much.